Hello Divas, Diamonds, and Dolls. Welcome back to our YouTube channel, Femininity with Mama Gail. Today, let's have a little conversation. Let's talk about the thing that the masculine man is attracted to. He's drawn a lord to. And that is the scent of a woman. The scent of a woman. I'm not talking about Dolce Gabbana light blue. I'm not talking about happy for women. I'm not talking about Marc Jacobs decadence. I'm not talking about million dollar woman. I'm not talking about any mist or oils or sprays and things of that nature. Bubble baths. No. I am talking about the feminine energy. The feminine energy is the scent that the masculine man is drawn to. And he is drawn to the scent of the feminine woman because this feminine woman has something that he needs. The thing that she has that he needs first is she is open, open to receive. She's a receiver. Because the feminine woman is laid back, she's in a posture of receiving. She's open. She's vulnerable. She is allowing him to come in, to enter. And not just to VJ, but to enter into her space, a place of softness and sweetness and tenderness and passion and compassion and luring and drawing and he comes he enters he feels safe he's in a safe place where he can trust because she has the dominant energy that he needs for rest for calm for peace the cares of the world, the storms of business, life is taking control and taking hold of the masculine man and he has no place to lay his head. And because of that, it is the scent, the attractiveness, the need, even though he won't admit it, the need for the feminine woman. The masculine man wants to come in. He wants to pierce. He wants to penetrate. He wants to enter. He wants a pillow, a soft place, a confidant to lay his head on, to trust with his inner secrets, with his fears. He want to be able to rest in the firm bosom of feminine presence. So this is the scent that he is drawn to. He is drawn to the openness. Men see feminine women as vulnerable and innocent in the sense of not being foolish as the masculine woman says we are fools for men and things of that nature but the masculine man sees her innocent in the sense of she's different from the average woman and that innocence is, is equated almost to virginity uh, being a virgin but not being a virgin if you understand what I'm saying, he puts her in a category, the feminine woman in a category where she has something that's priceless. She has something that's going to contribute to his life, to build, to strengthen him when he is weak. Because every man, I don't care what his profession is, what he does, he wants a soft place to lay his head 
He wants a woman that he can trust enough to be successful, to be who he is, and be able to come home and relax and rest and find peace without being nagged and controlled and told what he didn't do and what he needs to do and things of that nature. And that's not to say that men don't have responsibility in the household, but anywho, we're talking about the scent of a woman. That scent is so sensual to a man. Men are natural givers. They love to give. They love to please their woman. They love to see her on top of her game. So because she's soft and sweet and sensual and in a place where he can find rest and peace within the feminine presence of this woman, he'll give her her heart's desire. And it's not about the material things, but the, be, the things that women long for nowadays conversation and intimate time quality time and going out and conversation again we long for the man to open up and talk and be real and share his cares and what's going on with him and things of that nature a lot of men, whenever they get too close, if they don't trust you, they're going to pull away. They're going to walk away. If you don't have that scent that they're looking for, that presence, that attractiveness. And you may not be the most beautiful woman on the outside, but because of the femininity, your presence, the energy from within illuminating out of you. There's something about you. That scent. That he respects. He trusts. He loves. He's falling in love with. Because you have something that he needs. It's a scent. That only femininity can give to masculinity to compliment to flow and ride the wave together to complete to compliment but never compete with each other that scent that innocence of the feminine woman that trust can lay my cares here my worries here I can trust her she's not a gossip she's not a run around she's not manipulative she's not trying to control me she's sweet and meek but in no way is she weak that scent is beautiful to the masculine man. Feminine energy cannot be faked. It is not us dressing up and looking like something that we are not because the masculine can sniff out and smell and know in his knower whether you are the real thing or not because the scent of femininity radiates, illuminates, and draws out of the woman and pulls in the masculine man. If there is no pull and there is no attraction outside of your body, outside of your attraction on the outside, there's no inner beauty you may get him but I promise you 
it'll be temporary if he's truly looking for the scent of the feminine woman. Because soon as a truly feminine woman comes along, he's going to be out. If you don't transition into being a truly feminine woman, you're going to lose him. He's attracted to the scent of a woman and that scent is in femininity because femininity has what masculinity needs, craves, longs for, desires. You don't have to play games when you're feminine. You don't have to be manipulative when you're feminine because whatever you want, a masculine man, he will give because not only is he giving, but you are giving him also in return. And what you are giving him is priceless to him. It's rare and hard to find. Real femininity. This is what the masculine man needs. This is what he wants. This is what he desires. And it's the scent that he's looking for. If you don't have it, work on you. Work on being soft and sweet. Work on you from the inside. Work on healing from past relationships, from past dealings, from past disappointments, from your manipulative tactics, things of that nature. He can sense these things. And if you're trying to trick him by playing feminine, and then you get played, you get ghosted, you get breadcrumbed because you look like something that you're not. You cannot play victim when you try to fool a man who already knows the scent of the feminine woman. This is Femininity with Mama Gail. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Have a blessed and prosperous day, divas, diamonds, and dolls.